Welcome to CA Technologies. In this informational video, you will learn how to install the CA Endeavor SEM Eclipse plugin, connect to Endeavor, and start using. Assuming you already have the Endeavor product installed and Endeavor web services configured and available, the only other prerequisite is to have Eclipse. Eclipse is one of the more widely used integrated development environments. You can download the free standard Eclipse distribution at the Eclipse.org website. Once the download is complete, you are now able to run the Eclipse and ready to install the Endeavor plugin. Within Eclipse, select Help. Install new software. You will see the installation wizard open. Click Add. There are several fields to complete that include name and location fields before clicking OK. In the Name field, specify the name of the update site to your choosing. In the Location field, enter the URL of the Endeavor Eclipse plugin update site. Once the new Endeavor Eclipse plugin update site is added, you can proceed with installation. The available software window appears. Select the checkbox next to Endeavor Eclipse plugin and click Next to proceed to the installation of the Eclipse-based UI. The Install Details window appears and click Next. Agree to the license agreement and when prompted to confirm the installation, click Finish. A progress bar appears and may take several minutes to complete the installation process. When prompted to restart Eclipse, click Yes. The Select a Workspace window appears. Once the Workspace folder is designated, click OK. The Eclipse-based UI is now installed on your computer. So, let's now put Eclipse to work and connect to CA Endeavor SEM. Click on the Window tab atop of the UI and select Open Perspective. Then select Other. The Open Perspective window opens. Select Endeavor from the list and click OK. A new panel called Repository View is seen in the upper left of the screen. You are now able to create a new connection to an Endeavor repository. On the toolbar of the view, select New Repository. The new Endeavor repository window opens. In the Local Repository Name field, define a name. Next, type the Web Services URL. Fill in your mainframe credentials and password. Click Next. The CA Endeavor SEM configuration window appears. Select the Endeavor instance and click Finish. Please wait for the connection to Endeavor as it may take a few moments. On the currently defined repository, click the arrow to expand a list of all available systems, subsystems, environments, and stages. You will now create a project where you can work with your elements. Right-click on the stage and select Add Project. The new Project Definition dialog window opens. In the Name field, type your project name. Type in a default CCID. Remember that you can always change this later. Fill in the filter of the elements you want to find in the Element Filter Pattern field. Next, fill in the type of filter pattern of the element. Select Finish. Eclipse will now be able to find the elements to correspond to your search in Endeavor. Now you can see your elements. Double-click the element to retrieve it. You now see the element in the central panel where you can begin to make your edits. For more detailed information about Eclipse-based UI for CA Endeavor SEM, you can go to the product documentation visit the CA communities, or see the learning paths. Thank you for watching this video.